Hey friends, welcome back to Llama Mama Kayla's Yarn Tube. I'm Kayla. Thank you for stopping by for a visit today. Today's video is going to be a little different. It's not about yarn. We are going to go on a little drive to look for Christmas lights. So I want to invite you guys to come along with us. And so I will tell you this first little clip. Um, I did not realize how dirty Big Daddy's windshield of his truck was until I started filming that. And it's just about one minute and eight seconds long, but his windshield was very dirty and I didn't realize that. But we live on a dirt road and he works about an hour away from home and he takes some back road shortcuts that are dirt roads and farm roads and stuff to get to work so his windshield was always dirty and I just did not pay attention so come on let's go for a ride So that road that we drove down that had the lights in the air, you know, across the roadway, that is called Antique Alley. Um, it is a street that is just full of little neat little shops, a lot of antique shops, a lot of resale shops. Um, it's fun to go and just look around in those stores. I don't get to go very often. I used to go more than I get to go now. Um, but they close at like 5 in the evening. And Big Daddy doesn't even get home until 6 in the evening. And they are open on Saturdays. But Saturdays, it is so wrapped up. There's no place to park. And there's just so many people. So we don't ever get to go anymore. But used to, um, back when I still had a vehicle, <laughs> um, I would go all the time and just, you know, look for different things or whatever. And when De Elijah was a little younger, we would go to this certain little resale shop there and look for things to make costumes and deal stuff like that with. But um, it's very a very neat little street. And then as we turned the corner, we came upon this little park with a walkthrough display of Christmas lights and so Big Daddy parked and I got out and walked through and filmed that for you guys and it was very cute
that was very enjoyable. I loved all those lights. I loved just slowly walking through there and looking at the lights and such. But the best part was there was just kids running around, playing everywhere. They were screaming and having so much fun. It made me miss my kids being little. It did. It really did. <laughs> but it was very, you know, it was a lot of fun just seeing kids running around having fun. The lights were like so cute and um, magical to me. Just how imagine how magical and spectacular they looked to these little kids. And they were just running around screaming with delight and just having a grand old time. <clears throat> And that's a free little park. Um, you just go in and walk around, you know, and then leave, I guess. But um, some parents were just hanging out, letting their kids play and such. If I had little kids, I would totally take a lawn chair, <laughs> set up under one of these awesome trees, and let my kids just play until somebody peed their pants, which would be me. <laughs> But anyway, they um, they they had a neat little idea there, and I like that. I hadn't seen this little park before in past years, so I think that was a great thing for them to do. <coughs> in the next clips, we just went driving around, and I was just taking little random clips of lights that I saw. And so that was... Um, Nothing that spectacular, but just showing different lights around in my town.
we were in our son Dakota's neighborhood, so we just pulled up at his house, and I called him and said, hey, what you doing? He said, oh, I just got home, and I said, well, I like your Christmas lights, and he said, you stalker, where are you at? <laughs> and he came outside and talked to us um, for a little bit at the truck, um, tell us about his day and just different things, you know. We didn't go in because... Um, Big Daddy and I both had to potty, <laughs> and we can't go in, in Dakota's to go potty because his only bathroom is upstairs, and those stairs are, like, straight up, and we can't do that. So, we just talked to him for a moment, and then we left. So, this next little clip is just a glimpse of where Dakota lives. This is a duplex, and his side is with the one with the Christmas lights. His neighbors had some lights up, and I said, oh, they have Christmas lights up too? He said, no, they that's still their Halloween lights. And I said, oh, I would totally turn those on. <laughs> he said they were orange um, Halloween lights. So anyway, this next little clip is where our son Dakota lives. Thank you guys for coming along with us on our little drive through looking for Christmas lights. Um, we did learn of some more places of Christmas lights, and so we're going to go one day next week and look for more Christmas lights around town, uh, a different area of town. So, um, yeah, look for another Christmas light drive through video next week. But I hope you guys enjoyed that, and... Um, we did a couple more things while we're out, and I will tell you more about that in today's video, which will be day nine video, and it will be later on today. So come back and join me for another video this afternoon. It'll probably be late this afternoon, to be honest. <laughs> so guys, I hope you're having a great day, and I will see you in the next video. Bye, friends.